G'day ladies and gents, welcome to Xresart. In this demonstration I was testing a different technique and wanted to improve on my loose strokes and somehow make the subject realistic. I wanted to show movement by way of colour and painting bold expressive strokes. Just a little pause to talk about Patreon. Uh, head on over to my Patreon channel if you would like to learn about the various techniques, tips, tricks and unusual projects where I show you real-time step-by-step projects and give you insights as to how I create my artwork and give you confidence to paint and draw. So back to the painting. The art supplies I use are pan pastels, pastel pencils, bristle brushes, soft tools and all kinds of tools to give the effects I'm going for. This piece is a uh, 50 by 35 centimeter uh, piece of pastel mat and have to say this was a joy to paint. With the help of the soft tool sponges and other tools I was able to apply the background quite quickly as you can see. There are quite a few colours going down on the surface and I especially uh, was careful not to make mud. Having an idea of colour theory uh, does help uh, when you're painting this style. I will put a pop-up on a few videos that I've done in the past that refer to colour mixing and blending uh, that might be of interest to you. Also, um, there is some real time of this project which was conducted over a few live streams. Uh, you can uh, see how quickly the background was created then. And uh, speaking of live streams, I live stream about once a week on YouTube, uh, which is a casual hangout where we discuss all things art and everything else. So I invite you to join in the chat and ask as many questions as you can. If I can't answer them, there is sure to be someone uh, in the chat that will be able to help. The focal point here are the three faces. Uh, I wanted to make the faces realistic, but with loose strokes and to just define certain areas like the eyes, the nose and the mouths uh, with um, a, a small a small bristle brush or bristle brushes uh, to give me uh, some details in the faces. You will see I didn't use skin tone shades as such but rather values to make the faces look realistic. What I'm trying to say is that values and contrast are the most important thing. I could have uh, these faces pink with blue with blue polka dots uh, so long as I've got the values and the contrast in the correct places I'm home and hosed and yes that even applies to the hands um, that uh, you will see me paint uh, down the track as well I also used uh, pastel pencils over the pan pastel uh, layers which worked quite well. If you have enjoyed and found this video helpful, uh, please share and subscribe uh, so you don't miss out on any of the live streams and videos as I upload them. My name is Chrissy. Thank you so much for watching. Keep on keeping on and I'll see you next time.
Thank you.